Welcome, Emma. That incident at the top of the city. That was superb work. Putting an end to that crisis all by yourself. Oats. It wouldn't be fair to say that you alone ended the crisis. You overcame that difficult situation by working as one with your Pokémon. We train and raise Pokémon by giving them items and by teaching them new techniques about. But we ourselves also learn many things from Pokémon. And this is where your achievements are put to the test against what others like you have achieved. Now, who can most elegantly dance with their Pokémon in Hoenn? Show me! Right here and now! Champion Wallace would like to battle. Starting off the battle with a level 57 Whale Lord that looks so shrinky dink in comparison to its actual hot size. Anyway, pure water type with the ability Water Veil and the moves Rain Dance, Water Spout, Double Edge, and Blizzard. That was to be expected. So yeah, Wallace is no slouch. Can we pull this off? Can we fuck this up? Yes and yes. Again, I really would have felt more comfortable with, uh, if a Pokémon knew an Electro-type move. But, oh well. So, already, already going with his strongest Pokémon. His own Milotic, level 58. Water-type with the ability Marvel Scale. Holding a Citrus Berry, of course, with the moves Recover, Surf, Ice Beam, and Toxic. Alright. For, for all the bitch- Really? Fucking really? Why is- Why is- Freezing even a fucking status ability when- It rarely ever does it ever seem to actually work and when it does, the Pokemon just magically fucking defrosts anyway! I forgot what I was gonna fucking say! Uh, oh yeah, for all, for all my bitching and whining about like being overleveled for like gym leaders and such, right? And then getting here and it's like... Being just about the same level as the strongest... Like, yeah... Well, since apparently we're playing the status game... Can I get this fucking stun spot off before I die? Alright, that's gonna help me... A little bit? I'm gonna say a little bit. Oh, fuck me. Alright, well... Because look, then then do do much. Actually, it might help. Actually, it might help in regards to like me getting off first. But considering that it's now like doing half damage, half of my full health damage. Fuck it. What am I trying to say? You, you get the idea. I uh, like it's annoying. It's fucking annoying. Like I I would like it if it if it fucked off. I would like it if it just, yeah, went to hell in a handbasket, preferably. Okay, so yeah, it's not, it's not being paralyzed. That's great. I somehow keep getting fucking defro uh, frozen, and this time I didn't defreeze immediately, but you never know. Wow. 
Finally? I mean, I'm fucking frozen, so what the hell am I gonna do? And then, of course, he just goes right back to Ice Beaming, because, of course... I haven't been keeping track of how many Ice Beams it's used. Because it should only have 10. Right? That's the default for Ice Beam, I'm pretty sure, so... Alright, cool. I'll, um, go fuck myself, okay? Like, apparently it has 8 billion fucking Ice Beams, and it doesn't really get fucking paralyzed. Oh, I'm getting mad now. Please, for love of God, kill it. Are you fucking kidding me?! Finally. Fucking finally. Alright. Jesus. H. McGillicuddy. Of course, it's gonna send out tentacle. And guess what? You know, it's being, being that it's part poison, it's weak to, uh... Weak, weak to psychic, and of course, uh, Shikova, you know, I sent out to... You know... Try and do some damage, but of course, obviously, the mild take had recover, and being annoying as all hell. Anyway, I'm tangenting. Uh, tentacle. Water poison type with the ability clear body with the moves toxic, hydro pump, sludge bomb, and ice beam. Because everything needs to have ice beam. Ice beam's so fun. I love ice beam. This really would have been the best time to have a Pokemon that knew an electric type move! I'm not gonna stop bitching and whining about it. Because it really would come in handy for these situations. But hey, I'm the one that, that chose this team, okay? For some reason, I thought August could learn Thunderbolt for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe I was confusing it with someone else, but. Anyway, Gyarados, Water Flying type with Ability Intimidate, Nose Moose, Dragon Dance, Earthquake, Hyper Beam, and Surf. Oh. oh okay. I mean, I, I don't know what you were trying to get off Gyarados, but maybe you couldn't have spent 8 billion turns. Upping your speed in the tank just to get pwned by a fucking dust box. Alright. So we've, we've gone over the hill. Miraculously, somehow, we have gotten over the fucking hill that was that bloody Milotic, so... Next up is a little Kulo, level 56, water grass type, with the moves Giga Drain, Surf, Leech Seed, and Double Team. With the ability Swiss Swim. But no one on his team. Oh no, Whale Lord did, but Whale Lord didn't get a chance to get off Rain Dance. So for the uh, for the Swift Swim to be useful. Yes, kill Aiden again. Alright, his final <laughs> Pokemon, as crazy as that is to say, is Wishcash. Level 56, Water Ground type with the ability Oblivious, and the moves Earthquake, Surf, Amnesia, and Hyper Beam. Wishcash being Water Ground means it's quad times. How do I fuck up words so easily? It's Four times weak to grass. Quadruple. 
pod times. I don't fucking know, but... So unless... Somehow... This goes tits up... Dude, dude had like... Supposedly he has four restores. Four full restores, sorry. Portable figure, anyway. Um... Like, I could've sworn there were times, like, I know, like, the monotech was using recover, so I was kinda, I guess... For my- luckily for me, fucking it out of using full restore, seemingly. Cause, yeah, there definitely was an op- when, when it was at 1 HP, that would've been, but... We did it! I, the champion, fall in defeat. That was wonderful work. You were elegant. Infuriatingly so. Oh, you, you 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 want to talk about something being infuriating, huh? And yet it was utterly glorious. Kudos to you, Emma. You are truly, yeah, you are a truly noble Pokemon trainer. <coughs> oh fucking hell! <coughs> Jesus. Uh, the the Pokemon you sent into battle. At times they dance like a, a spring breeze, and at times they struck like lightning. All right, yeah, okay. Rubbing it in, rubbing it in that I didn't have any electric type moves. I get it. It was light, yet sure-footed elegance that led your Pokémon. Even I felt but dazzled by your masterful performance. You now stand at the glorious peak of the Pokémon League. I now proclaim you to be the new Hoenn Regent. How the fuck did you get in here? Emma! How would you like some advice before you challenge the champion? No, seriously, how did you get in here? You, you're you a fucking punk-ass bitch that got beaten time and time again. Emma, are you trying to tell me you've been the champion? You? A girl? See? What did I tell you, Brandon? Didn't I tell you that you didn't need to worry about Emma? Emma, you've finally done it. When I heard that you defeated your own father at the Pellberg Gym, I thought perhaps you had a chance. But to think you actually become the champion. Ah, uh, yes. What became of your Pokedex? Oh, uh, yeah. Hmm, yeah, about that. Hmm, hmm. So you've seen 166 Pokemon and you've caught 143? I heard of Pokemon that evolve when they come to fully love their trainers. Yeah, ha have I encountered any Pokemon that evolve at full friendship? I don't think I have. I don't... Yeah, I... J I Honest to god, I don't recall any of the Pokemon that... I'll have to look into it, but I really don't think there, there's that many in this game that require full friendship to evolve. Or high friendship, I guess, but... Anyways, congratulations! Now, go proudly into the final room. Emma. No, let me rephrase that properly. The new champion. Come with me. Uh, I, I'm, I'm sorry, but... From here on, only those trainers who have become champions will... Uh, yeah, you little fuck! Fucking bitch! Get the fuck out of here! Yeah, go away with Professor Bitch! I mean, Birch, sorry. Can't be helped to that's the rules. Emma, way to go, congratulations! Yeah, you fucking Steven with jealousy, aren't you? This room. This is where we keep records of Pokemon that prevailed through harsh battles. It is here that the League Champions are honored. Looks also got a nice, shiny floor. Come on. Let's record your name as a trainer who triumphed over the Pokemon League and the names of the partners who battled with you. Aiden the Blazer Kitten. That was a thing. Padma the Valbloom. Supersonic the Flygon. Bella the Milotic. Shikoba the Zatu. Argress the Duskops. Welcome to the Hall of Fame. League Champion! Congratulations! 
Yeah, don't 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 look at the time. No, don't don't look don't look at the time. Okay. It's... Please don't. And with that, our journey is not over. It was an original Pokemon Emerald adventure, but there are actually still several things that we can do. Also, here's all the Pokemon you, you caught. I caught, but you know. So, <laughs> if I only bother to catch like my main, you know, party, and then like the, the couple of like HMs or something, yeah, I'm pretty sure they would just keep repeating or something probably. But anyway, I'm I'm, I'm gonna let this this play out now as uh, yeah. But like I said, this adventure is far from over. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.